Here we are at the Royal Reserve. Uh, as you can see behind me, we do have a, uh, a punch code access gate that would be used to get in and out of here, so it does give you some privacy. Where are we located? Well, we are located right in the middle of the reserve, and if you're not sure what the reserve is, it's the uh, very nice golf community, Jack Nicholas Golf Course, so we're located in the center of that. We're, uh, if you're going north on Highway 133 up towards Highway 11, Pickens County side of the lake, you would take a left on Pine Grove Church Road, follow it for a couple miles, you're actually driving through the reserve community, and then you would turn right on Royal Reserve Drive, and that'll bring you right to this point. So 13 waterfront home sites in this community. Uh, they do have a uh, own little private boat ramp in here, uh, some very nice homes. I think everybody that's in here pretty much would use this as a second home because of uh, you know just the area and, and, and being as private as it is to get back in here. All the uh, lots have deep water, some have mountain views, and uh, range from anywhere from about six tenths of an acre up to, I think the largest property in here would be 1.8 acres. So let's head inside, take a look at some of the home sites and the homes that are, that are in here and give you a good understanding of what this is all about. Here we are, Lot 12, the Royal Reserve, and uh, this special piece of property, as you can see from the very top, You've got this uh, really nice mountain view. Actually, I can see the very top of the Jocassi uh, Dam up there. So you're looking north towards the mountains. That's cool. And then as you can see, you've got a nice lake view down below. Um, up here on a cul-de-sac, this is a 0.85 acre lot, so close to an acre in size. The little uh, entrance we've got coming here, you've got an easement access that goes into lot 12 and to lot 13. There's actually a very nice home being built on lot 13 right now, which we'll see as we get down to the building area. And uh, we've got a nice grade here for a basement home, good deep water, dock in place, riprap already in place, and again, just a great little community. Um, only got 13 waterfront lots in here and it is surrounded by the reserve. So you're talking about high-end homes all in this area and a great location. Let's head down to the build site. Here we are down at the build site looking back up uh, the road. I think you just kind of come on and do a little zigzag. As you can see, a very nice home being built on lot 13. They're actually doing a little work over there today. They've elected to build a little higher on the lot to pick up the mountain view, I'm sure. As we look on down towards the lake, you can see they've uh, actually built a little deck area, which is kind of nice. You can sit down there and watch the kids swim or just hang out and put a grill down there and uh, use that right now in the state that the lot's in. And as you can see, that is a U-shaped dock. So let's head down there. It is on deep water. Um, but again, I think this is a great site for a uh, lower level basement and virtually all hardwood trees on this property. So let's head on down to the dock. Looking back up at the build site now, and uh, another thing I like is you've got some nice mountain laurel down here towards the water that will be blooming probably in May. And uh, this is just a nice little setup, this deck down here. As you can see, I've uh, got a great view looking out of the cove. Uh, directly across is Cedar Creek. A little subdivision over there. And again, around surrounding Cedar Creek, you've got the reserve as well as the reserve surrounding the Royal Reserve. Now, if you look down, you see this is a U-shaped dock. A couple things you could do here. You could put a roof on that dock, or you could even have a double decker type setup if you just hire somebody to come in and build that and put that into place so you have options there uh, to cover that dock and you do not have to go through any type of uh, new approval with Duke to get that done. Uh, also you can add jet ski buoys at any time so as you can see the shoreline's been rip wrapped already great value good deep water great view Give us a call, 800-682-9098. Hey, you can see the mountain views that I was talking about. One thing I really like about this community, uh, at this point they've only decided just to develop the, the 13 waterfront sites. So as far as the interiors, uh, you've just got land in here that doesn't have anything on it. Um, come on down there, you know, our home certainly 
in here are well over a million dollars. Here's one of the homes straight ahead that uh, second home, but this is on a 1.8 acre piece of property. That just is a beautiful house. You can see the cedar shake siding. Uh, that home is three levels over 5,000 square feet and just immaculate. I've been in it and sold this property as I've actually sold every property in here out of the 13, but that's an awesome house on a beautiful lot. We're going to take a look at some of the others. Another new home, uh, certainly well over a million dollar house. This home would have mountain views, um, well over 4,500 square feet, maybe 5,000 square feet even and uh, you know big time mountain views and then when we come on down to the point you see a smaller home here but uh, on a just a great piece of property um, very nice point lot again with some mountain views a little bit hard to see but you get a, an idea and we'll go from here over around to uh, some of the other homes and then the boat ramp area we've come down to the boat landing area we're looking across actually at cedar creek um, and as you see as we pan down you can see the boat ramp uh, for the community. So kind of nice, only 13 sites in here and you do have a boat ramp. Some very nice homes as you could see. Uh, great location and again if you've got any questions about this community or any other give us a call 800-682-9098.